In Madden NFL 25, one of the most difficult plays to stop for one yard uh, is the quarterback sneak. And here you're going to see, this is probably uh, something you're experiencing. Uh, a lot of times, guys, you could be in goal line, you could be in any formation, and, and it just seems like they just get through. For some reason, the quarterback sneak always gets that inch that they need for that touchdown or clutch first down and fourth down situations. Well, today we're going to solve your problems. We're going to show you how to stop quarterback sneak in Madden NFL 25. Now, the play we're going to focus on specifically today is from the 45 formation and it's the play zone blitz if you guys want to check out the play zone blitz I think it's a very dynamic play I think it's a top 10 defensive play in Madden 25 because of all the things that we can do with it and all of the things that gives us the versatility to have uh, at the line of scrimmage and, and one of them being uh, this run defense on the goal line so what we like to do with this is we're going to come out obviously we're going to call the play zone blitz in the 44 split formation this can be found in the um, 4-3 defensive playbook and all we're going to need to do here is we're going to sh um, shift our linebackers in and shift our defensive line in then what we like to do is we take the safety here we're going to blitz him straight down we're going to put him right over the center and we're just going to run commit straight down and at the snap of the ball oh I forgot one other thing forgot one other thing sorry about that um, you also when you uh, shift your D-line in you want to crash your D-line down uh, so that they come down, and now that's exactly what's going to happen here. Uh, and now, again, you're still run committing, still uh, blitzing Clark over the center, and now you see nowhere to go for the quarterback. Let's take a look at that in instant replay, and there's not a real science to this. This is just uh, trying trial and error, really, to be honest. But you see Joe Flacco gets shot, uh, stopped short of the first down, um, and this puts a lot of people in, in, in the line of scrimmage. And, and you're going to say, okay, well, what if they run power O? You know, if I see someone doing that to me, I'm going to run the power O. Well, obviously, that's obviously an opportunity. So here we're going to quick audible to the power O by using the new audible features. And now you're going to see the power O is going to be open for a run to the outside. How can you do? How can you stop the power O and the quarterback sneak at the same time? Well, this is something I'm still working on. Um, and uh, we're going to take a look at this. This is how far I've gotten. So again, we're still pinching them, still doing all that, crashing them down, all of that. Now we're just going to run commit to the right instead of run committing to the middle. And if we, when we do this, you see we still kind of stand the quarterback sneak up. Um, it's not as dominant as it was earlier on in the video. But it is very effective. Uh, it, it can still work. And again, I'll, if you have time, you could, you can. I really, really am a big proponent of putting these corners in light blue zones so they play the run a little better. But we're going to run commit to the right here, and you're going to see when we run commit to the right with the Clark over the center, uh, and they call the power O. He should be. We should be able to stop it. Let's see if it does. And there you see we got a guy over there, and with the Steelers' outstanding linebacking core uh, and hip power that they have to stop the run, it's going to be very difficult for them to get anything. And, and obviously, you don't need to base a line either. That's one thing I sometimes forget. You don't have to base a line, uh, which is nice out of this. But again, quarterback sneak. And now, now they're going to flip the run. So they're going to pat their butt like this. And they flip the run. And you see it's going to be open, but they kind of contest it. And that's just par for the course, guys, to be honest. I have not found that one play that will literally shut down every single running possibility for negative yardage yet. Um, at least not in the 4-3 defensive playbook. I know of 5-2. Uh, if you use the same tactic, you see when we, slide, when, we, um, when we don't run commit, it, it doesn't work properly. And when we don't... Um, Crash our defensive line down, it does not work properly on the run defense. But real quick, uh, I know of some people who who have, um, what's it called, 5-2 uh, pinch. They use the same tactic, and I believe that they uh, take, like I said, they take a safety. They either blitz him or quarterback spy him, and I think y both of them can be effective. And again, you're just coming forward at the snap of the ball holding L2 and you're just going to come forward. So that is the run defense out of quarterback sneak out of the 44 defense. I'm sure it can be replicated out of other formations. I just haven't tried it personally. I know that the 5-2 is one of those formations. So if you're using playbooks like Carolina because we broke down the 4-1-6 defensive scheme last week, you can check that out on the archives on the YouTube channel. Or if you're using playbooks like multiple defense so you can get 34 and 43 defenses in your playbook, then it also has, I believe, a 
two formation that you'll be able to use to stop quarterback sneak and inside runs like this on the goal line for negative yardage. Thank you guys so much for giving me another great opportunity to share with you something that I've been using to stop quarterback sneak in Madden 25. Do you have a specific defense you like for this situation? What do you like to do offensively in this situation if you know that they know how to stop it? What will you do? And also, guys, lastly, be sure to leave your favorite uh, goal line stand uh, story from your Madden career. Thanks for watching, guys. I really appreciate another great opportunity to share with you guys. And thank you so much. And be sure to subscribe to the channel for more Madden 25 content.